Space is beautiful yet mysterious, but the size of it all is absolutely mind-blowing. To comprehend the size of the universe, let's start with something simple, the average human being. The average human height is 69.3 inches or 5.8 feet tall, but for the sake of a big calculation later in this video though, we'll just round this number up to 6 feet tall. Now, if you're anything over this height, you might feel considerably tall, but the height of you is nothing compared to the length of California, 770 miles long. But this number alone, 770 miles, is easily beaten by something else, the length of the United States, 1,500 miles long. Go out a little further and you'll see something even bigger. North America, 5,500 miles long. Now let's pause here for a second. We just went from a human being to the Earth, and that's a fairly large jump with fairly large numbers. But if you think that's anything near large, think again. Neptune, the blue planet named after the Roman god of sea. Its diameter, 30,000 miles. A journey that would take nearly 21 days to cross in a car going 60 miles per hour. Jupiter, its diameter over 10 times that of Earth's, 85,000 miles long. And now for the last large body in our solar system, the Sun. Over a hundred times the diameter of the Earth, 865,000 miles. Now, once again we should take a break here because these numbers are getting fairly massive. Now, I don't know about you, but 865,000 miles is pretty hard to think of, so let me put that into reference for you. In a car going 60 miles per hour straight, it will take 600 days to cross that distance. Now, even though that distance, the length of the sun, is massively huge, the distance from the sun to the outermost reaches of the solar system is even larger, two light years. A distance so grand that light, the fastest thing that can ever exist, takes two years to cross. A distance which will take over 20 million years to cover in a car. So there's the solar system for you. But even the solar system, an over 20 million year long car ride can be made small. As we all know, the solar system resides in the Milky Way galaxy, a massive collection of stars, planets, and asteroids, and other solar systems that spans 100,000 light years. Our car ride across the length of this would span about 1.1 trillion years. And to top it all off, the observable universe. All of that we know exists. The length, 93 billion light years. The time it would now take to cover such a distance is over 1 quintillion years in a car moving 60 miles an hour. So now I ask you to remember back when I said that we would round 5.8 feet up to 6 feet. That was for our last calculation. If you lined up humans from head to toe for the length of the observable universe, 481 septillion, 100 sextillion people would be used. So now I leave you with one question. Feel small yet? Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. If you'd like to see some other content by Science Saturdays, be sure to click on the pictures below. Now, you guys, this was a different kind of episode. I normally go for a question and answer kind of episode, like why do we cry, why do we feel pain? But instead, today, I just kind of wanted to bring into your eyes how big this, not the solar system, how big the universe is. It's absolutely huge. And it's crazy. It's so hard to imagine. And I just wanted to share this information with you guys because I thought it was crazy awesome. So if you guys enjoyed this kind of different style video, please be sure to say so in the comments. And if you didn't, I'd like to hear that as well. But once again, if you enjoyed, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Science Saturdays, bringing free education to the modern world.